Mr. President, it was at this high-level segment last year that Vietnam formally presented its candidature for membership of the Human Rights Council for the term 2023-2025. We pledged to make positive contributions to the work of the Council in the spirit of mutual respect, dialogue and cooperation, ensuring all human rights for all. We stand ready to work closely with other member states and stakeholders to uphold the principles of the UN Charter and the international law and strengthen the efficiency and effectiveness of the Human Rights Council through dialogue, cooperation and mutual respect. We will promote the enjoyment of human rights and fundamental freedoms in a comprehensive and holistic manner in all civil, political, economic, social, cultural, and developmental aspects. Our efforts will focus on particular on the protection of vulnerable groups and combating violence and discrimination against them. The promotion of gender equality, especially for women and girls in the era of digital transformation, and on protection and promotion of human rights in addressing global issues, especially climate change. And we will work to promote the right to health, particularly in the unpredictable context of COVID-19 and other communicable diseases. The right to descend to work in joint efforts to achieve the 2030 Agenda for sustainable development and the right to quality education based on equality, opportunity and universal access.